World School. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, from all different walks of life. This presentation is for you, 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 and you, for everyone. For what I want to do is that I want to educate the general public on how to live, means and ways how to live, how to live a good life, how to challenge yourself and to be a better expression of yourself. And I am doing this from my closet. Not to say that this is the only place that I can exercise my work. But I feel comfortable here. I meditate here. I get ideas here. Good ideas come to me where I am. And I have greatness inside of me. And you have greatness inside of you. And if we work as a team, Jamaica, we can make Jamaica a better place. We just need a mindset, a good mindset. We do have a mindset, but we need a constructive mindset, a disciplined mindset to take you from where you are to the next level, to where you are supposed to be, to where your dream is by understand and knowing that the future lives inside of you. And what you do now determines on what you are going to do next. So we have to continuously live in the moment, from the moment we wake in the morning until we go to sleep at night. Some will get it, some will not get it. Some will get it in something else. Some will get it in something else. Some will get it from other mediums. This is my contribution. From the Prime Minister to the elderly to the one that has just been born today, the rich and the poor and the indifference, I say to you today, you all have a right to be here. I believe that team works make the dream work and everyone must pay their contribution in making a difference in life, in this life. If whatever you're doing is not working for you, it doesn't add any meaning or any value to your life. This means that you need to do the opposite of what you are doing. And this is how we live the flip side of the kind. Whatever is it that you are doing, short circuit, stop right now. Think about it. How have you been living your life for the last 10 years? For the last 15 years? For the last 5 years? What have you gained from what you are doing? How do you see yourself in the next 10 years, in the next 15 years? And in order to cross this bridge, it is very important that we educate ourselves in that area that we want to grow. It is more important than any and everything else that we do on a daily basis. We need to take our life seriously. Live your dreams. It is possible. It is possible that you can live a good life. It is possible that you can move from where you are. 
it is possible that you can develop yourself to a better expression of yourself, to a better version of yourself. It is possible that you can do more for yourself. Some people just have to work harder than some. A job is a bridge. A job is not your work. It's not your gift. A job is a bridge to take you into, to, to, to generate cash flow, to take you to the next level of your dream, to buy the things that you are supposed to buy. What if you want to have a dream home or a dream car and you generate cash flow to buy that car or to buy that home? You are successful at your dream. It is a part of it. And with that being said, in the same breath, I want to encourage every individual to have a vision board running their life. It is very important that you create a declaration for your life. Write a vision board and achieve your goals by any means necessary. For when it comes down to living your dreams and living a good life, no excuse is acceptable. If that's not working, move on to the next. If that's not working, move on to the next. And if that's not working, move on to the next. Keep on stepping. Keep on moving. If there's an idea up the ladder, up the chain, that you can reach out and pull something up that you were trying on before that was not working, pull it up to help you. We don't know how to live 90% of us. And we need to reverse this mindset because it is a mindset that is robbing us of an opportunity to live it is a mindset that keeps you stuck in the television it is a mindset that keeps you digesting garbage it is a mindset that keeps you distracted it is a mindset that keeps you procrastinating it is a mindset that keeps you lazy and it is a mindset that is going to take you out of that situation. You don't have to live like that. There are more meaningful and important things that you can do for your life. With your life. This is my work. This is my contribution back to life. And if I can do it, you can do it too. If Les Brown can do it, you can do it too. If Miles Monroe can do it, you can do it too. If Jim Rand can do it, you can do it too. If Oprah Winfrey, Tyler Perry, Ron Mouchette, Miss Venice Parchment, um, what's my friend's name from RFM, Ellie Skelly, Muta Baruka, if these people can do it, living the life that they their heart's desire that they believe in. I look up to these people. I salute them. This is where I stop to for direction. Florence Chauvel Shin. Denzel Washington. And, and, and my Jamaican entertainers. Reggae music. I listen to these people and extract meaningful, positive and constructive things, the good things that I can use as a tool to construct my life, to add some meanings and value to my life. Because I believe that I deserve to live a good life. I believe that I deserve to live my best life. And outside of my work, this is my purpose. This is what I do in my spare time. This is what I do late night. This is what I do early mornings. Educating myself to develop myself to a better expression of myself because I have lived to realize that majority of the population are distracted by sidetrack activities. We are not educating ourselves. We want this and we want that. 
about what are the ideas that you are developing to get there. You have to construct your mind. Educate yourself. Where do you stop to for direction? Who is your mentor? Who are you listening to? Who is feeding you information? Is it worth it? Where is it taking you? What have you gained? What have you learned? How are you living now compared to how you were living then? Do you have good saving skills? Are you disciplined? Are you making any contribution to your dream life? If you are not doing this, then you are on the other side of the kind. I say to you today that it's not too late to make a change, to make a shift in your life. It doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter where you are. It is possible. The last chapter of your life is when you die. You will not live to tell the last chapter of your life. In the same breath and the same time, at the same time, at this very moment, what are you doing with your life before you depart? this life we all are going to die one day but before you die look at yourself do not leave this life with just a headstone to remember you make a contribution for the next generation and the next generation and the next generation for your nieces and your nephews for your grandchildren. Break the cycle. Make a shift. Make a change. Make a difference. You can feel that, that inner feeling that is, that is touching you, that is shaking you, that is continuously reminding you that this is what you are supposed to do. Make a shift. Do it badly until you get it right. This is how we start from ground zero to greatness. From ground zero to the next level. From ground zero to where you want to be, to where you are supposed to be. It's not all about money. Money is just a part of it. It's all about creating ideas, developing new ways that can keep you going, keep your days lively, keep your mind active. Keep on stretching, keep on looking for ways to win. Ideas, ideas, ideas run the world. Ideas run your life. The clothes that you are wearing is someone's idea. The car that you are driving, it's someone's idea. That building that you work in, it's someone's idea. That book that you are reading or writing in, it's someone's idea. The very shoes that you wear, someone's idea. The road that we drive on, the sidewalk that we walk on, Someone's idea, that building over there, that construction, that this, someone's idea, ideas runs the world. And if you can develop a good idea, construct a good idea, and get people to pay you for your idea, what a wonderful way to live. What a wonderful way to live. 
Jamaica. I love you so much. We have work to do. We have work to do. We have a lot of work to do. So pick up your tools. Pick up your tool pan. Pick up your needle and thread. Isle up your sewing machine. Grease up off your grease up. Let's get started. Let's get started. Here is a good place to start. With you is a good place to start. It is individual work. Living your dream, your life. I can't live your life for you, you know. You can't live my life for me. It is my responsibility to take, to, 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 to take action with my life. It is your responsibility to take action with your life. It is our responsibility to make a difference in this life before we depart this life. Time is the life currency. We use time to buy life. We must understand and, and know this. And this is why it is very important that we educate ourselves continuously every step of the way. What is it that we want? What is it that our hearts desire? What is it that we need? What is it that we are supposed to do? What is it that we can do? This is real life, you know. This is real life and we have to get out of the fairy tale mindset and come down to earth. Do some gardening, do some farming. Clean out your room, clean out your house. Clean up your environment, be the manager of your life. And I encourage you today, study business management. Every single one of you, every human. Study business management. It will help you to manage your time and manage your life. Study business management. Be disciplined. Organize your life. Organize yourself. From zero to greatness. It is possible. Many can relate. I can relate. From zero to where I am. Children, teenagers, adult, grandma, grandpa, friends, brothers. You all, we all have a right to be here. Uncles, nephews, nieces, help me. We all have a right to be here and you can live a good life. With just the right mindset. We all can live a good life. Today is a great and amazing day. Buy a book. And do some construction. For your life. That is a good way to start. That is a good way to start. Saluting World School JA Foundation. We are also on Instagram. And we are expanding in mysterious ways. We are here for you. Working for you. Working with you. No charge. All we ask is that action is required to make a shift, to make a difference, to make a change in your life. I am depending on you. Jamaica is depending on you. We are depending on you. The next generation is depending on you. And we are Here 
waiting for you to get started. Now is a good time to start. We have a lot of things to talk about. Stay focused and we are in touch. We will be in touch. We are in touch. And this is just a part of it. And this is how we do it badly until we get it right. Ideas will come. And this is why it is very important to get started. And this is how I start a new leaf. Bye for now.